line. Right into the quad to the point. I love that blessed silver divine bright and all the tears far away of my Oh, 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 oh. 
God give you strength. Stand and worship God. Those young men down there, those young ladies in the box, stand and worship God. He give you life, he give you health. You are not pretty, you are not beauty. When you see salvation and God in your heart, you can see you're pretty and you're pretty. Stand and worship God. If he give you life, that why you come to church, Want to enter into the house of God, you must know to appreciate God's love, God's favor upon you. Now wait until you're sick, then you're about to pass. I can pray for you. Come on, you are in the house of God. We'll continue our worship by singing number six. While traveling through this world of sorrow, I'm on my way to Glory Land. I'll not turn back for a song tomorrow. My child here, I'll understand. While traveling through this world of sorrow.
never to stay, but you are coming back, Lord. And so glad we glad today, Lord, that our work here on earth, Lord, will not be vain, but a reward is awaiting us, Lord. Father, we lift up your name this morning. Father, we thank you for this very day, Lord. We thank you, oh God, for the blessings that you have given unto us this morning. God, we are so blessed this morning. God, we are in your presence. My God, and in your presence, there is fullness of joy. And Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus to the Lord, that you will help us to rejoice to the Lord, because the comforter has come. My God, so this morning, Lord, my God, we can rejoice, because the joy of the Lord is our strength. So God, today I pray, Lord, that every heart will rejoice in the God of our salvation, the one that prayed the bonds of our prison, the one who has set us free by his blood this morning. So God, this morning we are free, no longer bound, Lord. My God, we don't have to serve the devil. My God, you have loosed our bonds. You have set the captive free. God, you have delivered us from the bondage of sin. So this morning, Lord, we can rejoice. I call for the rejoicing spirit of Almighty God to saturate this place, Lord. Because God, we have a hope and a few. Mighty God, I pray, God, that you will help your people to press. Press forward, Lord. Yes, the battle may be hot. The conflict sore, Lord. But we have a better land in view. My God, not many days, Lord. We shall inherit, Lord, an eternal rest. So I pray, God, this morning that you will help your people. Help us, Lord, not to give up, Lord, but with a conquering trade. God, help us to push ahead because all eternity is awaiting us, Almighty God. Spirit of the living God, fall afresh and fire today. Lord, we pray, God, the only spirit will welcome in your presence today, God, is the spirit of Almighty God. We know we are your people gather, Lord, other spirits are over coming. But God, we render all your works powerless to the God. And we declare that the Spirit of Almighty God will bring breakthrough, will bring deliverance, will bring victory, Almighty God. We pray, Almighty God, as your words are about to be read, Lord. I pray that you will breathe upon them, Lord. That as they come forth, Lord, they will come with power. They will come with anointing. That they will resonate in our hearts, Lord. And God, we will use them to over travel our way through, Lord. Because your word it is quick, it is powerful, it is sharper than any two-edged sword. My God, we leave the remaining portion of the service in your hand. And we say unto you, Lord, today, have your own way. As we, oh God, submit ourselves to your heart and ask today, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Bless the name of the Lord. Worship the name of the Lord. Our first lesson will be taken from Isaiah chapter 9, from 1 to 7. When I find it, say amen. Bless the Lord. I will read while you follow. Nevertheless, the dimness shall be sought. Bless the Lord. Our ladies lay converts. Okay. Now we have a few of them here. I did. I want to hear your testimony. You can come on the front bench and, and also. Yes, Sister Zaria McDonald. Who is there again? Well, a pin up. Aya Dixon. Dixon. Well, Dixon. Okay, yeah, remember that's these two seasires. Who is there again? Any else there? No one else is there? Yes, for your picks. Now you come up so far this morning that you're surprised. <laughs> yes, sir, you're here to hear your testimony this morning. And so you can just sit on the seat for a bit until we 
gets here, therefore. Sister Dixon, our head was a long time of anything from you. Know? I want to hear something from you this morning. Glad to have you, Brother Burl. God bless you. God keep you. God strength in you, sir. Good morning. Yes, Brother Burl, sir. Yes, one of your testimonies, sir. As we proceed, as you, we must be aware of this, that it is Supper Sunday. It's Supper Sunday, so is the sermon will be a supper sermon, therefore. Okay? So we just proceed. So we're going to dismiss by 12.45. This is the one now. 11. Which I'm going to right. 11.30. 11.25. Okay? So as we continue in our worship, we're going to ask Sister El Palma to come and pray our national and international prayer for the soul for sick. As all the tithes and the offering, all of them in one. And this speaker also. Let us all stand. Yes, Mr. Douglas, your testimony also. Please come on the front bench, Mr. Douglas. Also. Let us all stand. Praise the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Father, we give you thanks, we give you praise. We honor you, God, because you are God. We lift your name on high, Lord, because there is no like unto you. And this morning as we gather in your house to worship, Lord, I pray, Almighty God, as we come, I pray, God, that you just help us to set our mind, our thoughts at the place just to worship you. And God, as we come this morning, Lord, God, I pray, place everything into your hands, Lord. God, you can do, Jesus, what we can't do. Amen, God, and I pray this morning as we come, sweet Jesus, that your angel will descend from heaven. Amen. In our midst, Lord. God, you are already here. It's a kind to feel his presence. He's already here. God, help us just to open our hearts. Amen. And then you can come in. Mighty God, as we are here this morning, God, remember our, our land, Jamaica, land we love. Amen. God, I pray this morning, Lord God, so many things are really happening. But God, without you, we are nothing. We are just like a ship without a sail. Amen. And God, wherever your children is right now, God, I place them all into your hands. Lord, I pray, God, that you may just deliver your children. Amen. There are so many, Lord God, need to be delivered, need to be set free. But without you doing it, Jesus, is just a failure. Mighty God, remember that, oh God, our government system, Lord, at times, God, it is so messy. But in the name of Jesus, I pray this morning, God, that you may just deliver your children. Set your children free, Lord. Amen, God. Without you, Lord God, this, the country, Lord God, cannot be, cannot run the way that it should. Help your people, Lord God, just to look to you, just to trust you. Amen, God. So many put their trust in man. But without you, God, it's just a failure. This morning, God, we place everyone into your hands, Lord. Right now, God, I pray you may just visit the hospital, sweet Jesus. Each and every one, God, you know where they are, Lord. God, remember some of the homes, Lord Jesus. God, your children are there, Lord Jesus. Some cannot help themselves. But God, I pray that you may just deliver your children, set your children free. Amen. And God, help us, your children, as we are here this morning. Whatever we can do, Lord Jesus, help us to do it heartily. Help us to do it, God, with our whole heart. God, some are there in the hospital, Jesus. If they don't lift their hands, God, they can't lift it. But you are the great deliverer. You are the great healer. And mighty God, I place them all into your hands. Deliver your children, see Jesus. So many sicknesses, so many diseases, but you are the healer. Mighty God, I pray that you may just cover your children under your blood. Mighty God, remember your speaker today, Lord. I place him into your hands, Jesus. He's your servant, Lord. God, I pray, may us deliver him, Lord. Touch his lips right now today, Lord. God, he can do nothing of himself. God, if he just put his trust in you because you are God. Mighty God, remember the offering, sweet Jesus. Bless your children as, you, as they put forth our to give. I pray God, may us bless the givers, sweet Jesus. Continue to provide for your children. 
We look to you, God. We place everything into your hands. Lead today, Lord, and help us to follow where you lead. We give you thanks, we give you praise, and God, we give you all the glory. Cover us under your blood today. We look to you and we tell our thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much. Okay, can you stand in where I want to sing? Song and they will testify only one song very shortly. But please remember that 1245 is special practices from 1 o'clock to 2 o'clock, so nobody leave. Okay, fire. Um, rally is very near on us, so is that clear? So, we're just going to do is this ask our young converts to testify. Lord, you are more beautiful than diamonds. Beautiful and gold. As a sister Myrtle, I'm going to ask her to share her testimony with us also. A long time we don't hear. So, every one of us going to stand, stamp our feet, clap our hands, and belt out our mouth, giving God song. Is that clear? Yes. Oh, yeah, so let's go ahead. Lord, you are more precious than silver. Lord, you are more costly than gold. Lord, you are more beautiful than diamonds, and nothing that I desire for me. Praise the Lord. This morning, I'm so happy to be here at the right place. And I want to tell you one another. I know answer on the 18th of December, 2022, when I made my vow. You know, it's going all around, all around. There's a temptation. In it. And I know I cannot just step over them. But I always pray to God. God, Father, God, help me. So, this man, I'm asking you. Count in the premium in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Let us praise the Lord. Let us praise the Lord. You could not praise Jesus for yourself. And you could not help and pray for yourself. From October going to a very problem. And enough that he feel like now I'm gonna make it. And without God, I met me here today. Yeah, so let's give thanks on this. Yeah. <laughs> 
Consciousness that without God, without God, we will say that they are not so they can't make it. And we remember our time, huh? Remember what I just walk with them, pray for them, and encourage them. The great God will build them as they go day by day. Sister Russell, Sister Russell, Sister Russell. Senior Foundation member, Sister Russell. Uh, from Sister Russell. From Sister Russell, long time ago, hear your voice. the name of the Lord. Lily of the valley, let your sweet aroma fill my life. Rose of Sharon shows me how to grow in beauty in God's sight. Fairest of ten thousand, make me a reflection of your light, of your light. 
the shine of holy. Let your love shine through me in the night. Lead me, Lord, I follow anywhere you open up the door. Oh, yes, let me know your wisdom. Show me things that I've never seen before. Oh, Lord, I want to see your weakness. You can take what's wrong and make it right. Make it right. Let your love shine through me in the night. Lead me, Lord, I follow anywhere you open up the door. Oh, let me know your wisdom. Show me things that I've never seen before. Oh, Lord, I want to be a witness. You can take what's wrong and make it right. Make it right. Shine on me. Let your love shine through me in the night. Oh, lead me, Lord, I follow anywhere you open up the door. Let me know. You can take what's wrong and make it right, make it right. They saw shine going on me. Yes, let your love shine through me in the night. Yes, lead me, Lord, I follow. Oh, anywhere you open up the door. Oh, let me know your wisdom. Oh, show me things that I've never seen before. Oh, Lord, I want. I want to be a witness. I want to be who can take what's wrong and make it right. Oh, right. Things start shining on me. Oh, let your love shine through me in the night. Yes, lead me, Lord, I follow, I follow, Lord, anywhere you open up the door. Oh, yes, let me know your wisdom. I beg you, show me things that I've never seen before. Yes, but I wanna 
be a witness. I wanna be. You can take what's wrong and make it right. Make it right. It's our time to Let your love shine you Come on, let me see the people, let me see the people that are receiving the shine. Those that were in darkness have seen a great light upon them the light of show. My God, they start. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. They start. Shine. My God, my God, my God. Let me, let me, let me. My God, what a love, what a love. What the love? Come on, amidst our situation at home. Amen. Amidst the bills to pay. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. We have a day star to shine upon us. Hallelujah. Come on and magnify God. Amen. Praise God. They were in the early church and they were beaten. They were put in prison. The Bible says at midnight because of the day star. For shine up on them. Come on, friends, you have to understand it. Amen. Praise God. They were singing and making melodies in their heart. Put the Lord. My God, come on. Today, nothing going to stop us from making melody in our hearts. To the Lord. It's they going to be saying, and some things, of course, amen. Some things have been said. Some things we must understand. Some things we must know. Reference belong to God. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Something we must understand and know. To God be the glory. You can have your seat. In brief to say, with the mother, we're glad to see all of our friends today that are in the house. Some we have not seen for some time. Many have since tea, but we are many. Amen. And today we are in the house and in the presence of the Lord. Giving thanks. Amen. So glad to see you one and all. Amen. Praise his name. It's my good friend. Keep coming. All right. Oh, praise his name. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name. And of course, today we just give the Lord thanks. Amen. For his love. Amen. To all us. And of course, amen. I just have a few minutes here. Amen. And so today I'll be just, we will be just looking. Amen. To the Lord's supper. Amen. Praise God. And of course, we'll be going straight into the supper service. Amen. Praise God. So, of course, it's very important. And so today, amen, praise God, we just want to understand it's not just been coming and going. It's not just, of course, that we are in church and we're having supper, but our great significance. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name to the most holy in the world. Amen. And always, amen, try. Amen. You know, we have to really respect the effort that you have made in serving the army. And yet he find time and place, amen, to be in the house of God. Amen. And the Bible says, when we draw near to the Lord, we draw near to us. And so my brother, he went for him, as I said, you have a big heart. You will not quite understand. But someday you will understand what I'm saying. As you see him sit there, amen, praise God, humbly. But you have a big heart, and the Lord is blessing him. Oh, praise his name. Praise God. So when we join you to the Lord, He will join you to us. He will take care of our business. Amen. We meet us chuckles. Amen. Oh, praise God. Beautiful day. And so, may I thank God that we can have children, of course, who curse to and they sit before us and they're going to keep giving us their best to mind. Amen. Praise His name. So, Amen. At least if I'm not getting it from you, don't tell the right beside me. The best to mind. <laughs> Amen. Oh, praise God. I mean, it's dead and born, but it is well. Oh, praise his name. Oh, praise God. God is just good. Amen. And we're in his presence to praise him and to worship him. Amen. And to understand that, of course, he never fails. Praise God. He never fails. The song, amen, that tour, of course, sung for the opening the first song. Amen. Praise God. Amen. God. Amen. Praise God. Wonderful number here from the churches. Hymnal, number eight from the church is Hymnal. Praise God, a beautiful song. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise His name. 
And of course, I, those who want to say to us there, Amen. Yes, uh, number eight, number yes. I love. I love. Who do I love? The blessed city. Amen. We sing, Amen. The last song again. I go. Uh, the last song? No. No, the, the song from, the, from our sisters. Praise God. Yes, we're. Praise God. We says, we're. Praise God. Amen. This, of course, can put us in it. Lead me, Lord, that's what I want. You are divine. So, amen. You are all knowing, you are powerful. Even when I'm even when I'm not seeing, understanding, you're leading. Somebody says, Lord. And the Lord trust your, your hands and trust your heart. Amen. amen. Praise his name. Praise God. What I want you to do, Lord, is to lead me. Amen. Lead me. Come on, church, with your right hands. Hallelujah. That's all that we need. It's going to be rocky at times, stiff at times, difficult at times. Amen. Even criticize at times. Come on, friends. Praise God. But Lord, lead me, Lord. Follow anywhere you open up the door. My God. Anywhere. I mean, this composer, no God. Because this God can lead to some places that we want to bow, we want to cry. Come on, friends. Amen. Amen. At times we want to dig the heart, we want to hide ourselves. Come on, friends. Amen. But he said, he has this confidence as Paul, or as the writer have said, Amen, to the Hebrew church 10 and 35. Cause that don't abandon your confidence in God. So this composer to understand the confidence. Amen. Praise God. Amen. This kind of that he has in God. So he says, Lord, I wish to a place that I can tell you, Lord, lead me anywhere. You open up the door, I'm going to go. I'm going to follow. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Because, amen, you are divine. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on and magnify God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God, my God, you are divine. We think of Joseph, of course, my God. Amen. He, the Lord gave him a, a gift, and of course, gave him gifts and gave him a dream. Amen. He told it to his uh, family. Amen. They were disappointed of him. Amen. Praise God. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. And it looked like this dream going nowhere. <laughs> Come on, at times, amen. Praise God. Our calling with the Lord is leading. Look like it's getting nowhere. Come on, church. My God, my God, straighten. Praise God. Straighten yourself. Straighten yourself to the Lord. Amen. We don't want a, we don't want a sad countenance. Amen. Amid the situation. Amen. Amid what is going on. Amen. Praise God. This Joseph with that, such a bright dream. My God, such a bright coat. <laughs> Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. The very coat was rubbed from him. Come on. Amen. Praise God. They will show into a pit. But it was still saying, from following his example, from following, praise God, amen, praise God, all the, the way he takes it, we could say that he recognized that the Lord, amen, was still with him. Amen. Praise God, he did not abandon his confidence in God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He did not abandon his confidence in God. So we could say to the word, say, please be Lord. I'm following anywhere from the pit, from the pit to the Ishmaelite. Lead me, Lord. Amen. Man, from the Ishmaelite, amen. Praise God. The principle of the word of God, the morals. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Yet he was criticized. He was accused, but it was still seen. We're not questioning God, Lord. Were you there? My God. How could you allow this to happen? Prison is the last place. That anybody want to be. Come on, friends. Hallelujah. Praise God. But he was still saying, Lead me, Lord. My God, if I could have a church that understand. Amen. The God we serve. Amen. Your mission, they are powerful. Amen. Praise God. Amen. He was still saying, Lead me, Lord. Why? Amen. Because even in prison, we're still getting dreams. 
Even if prison was interpreting, the gift was alive. The gift was not, of course, amen, as Paul would have said, amen, praise his name. Grieve not the Holy Spirit. Amen. Praise God. Now, as Paul would have said to Timothy, find, amen, praise his name. Amen, praise his name, what you have into fire. Come on. Amen. So no situation to the lowest, amen, to go tame or dismal. Amen. Praise God. Amen. We must understand the divine. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. Amen. So he was still saying, leave me alone because he was still getting, of course, amen. Dream was still coming to him and he was interpreted rightly. Amen. Praise God. Not just that. You know what? Touch me after all that Joseph have gone through. Wrongfully. Amen. He was among some people that was there just fully. Amen. In other words, they were getting their just reward. Amen. Yet he was bright among them, shining among them. Amen. As you wake up and look at their countenance. Amen. Praise God. He could see that it was not when I to ask them, What is wrong? I could see it in your countenance. Come on, church of God. Let's be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I pray God that is not seeing it in our countenance that we are not saying, Lead me, Lord. Amen. That we are disappointed in where He's leading us. Come on. Come on, brother and sister. Amen. And because of that, you could ask questions and then they could say, We have a dream. My God. Come on. Come on. Come on, friends. What a mighty God we serve. Oh, praise His name. What a mighty God we serve. Hallelujah. I love the blessed Savior the world. Why? Because no matter how Satan wanted to look dark or with this man. I know. God is going to brighten it up. Amen. Those who recognize and of course for. Amen. Praise God for this dream. You see, because he's divine. Amen. For this dream to come true. Then he has to get to Egypt. Amen. We follow him. Amen. That's where the bread is. <laughs> my God, my God. You have to go through the process. Amen. Praise God. Friends, friends, lift your right hand and say, God, help me to go through my process. Hallelujah. If we're going to come out as pure gold, we have to go through the process. Amen. Say, help me, God. Go through the process. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, say, help me, God. Go to the process. Hallelujah. I might not understand, Lord, but help me, Lord, because you are divine. Amen. You are divine. Amen. He knows that it was in Egypt. Amen. That the bread would have been the, of the corn. Amen. And food would have been plenty there. So for the very dream to be fulfilled. Come on, brothers and sisters. The calling of God upon us. And our life is very costly. Amen. Amen. Very costly. Amen. It will cost us rejection. It will cost us misunderstanding. It will cost us, come on, brothers, pain. Amen. Amen. Praise his name. Rejection. Amen. Praise God. But we must know. Amen. That's only the process. Amen. The divine is in control. The divine, the divine is in control. The divine is in control. My God, my God, my God, my God. Come on. Amen. Praise his wonderful name. Amen. Let's be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The divine is in control. Amen. My soul each day is tenderly feeding. You might not see. Amen. You might not see, but he's tenderly feeding. My soul, my God, come on. That's a good place to really just magnify God. Amen. Oh, praise his name. Amen. Praise God. Amen. The beauty, amen, in this, these words, from day to day, he is leading me hand. And where is leading me? <laughs> my God, do it look dark to you? Amen. It look dark to me? Amen. Praise God. But knowing that he is the divine, Amen. And it's a God of light. Amen. Come on, friends. Amen. And they come to take people out of darkness. Amen. 
Praise God and to place them in this marvelous light according to Amen. Isaiah 9. Amen. Come on. Praise God. Because we know he's a wonderful counselor. My God. Holy Spirit. He's a wonderful counselor. We know he's the mighty God. He's the everlasting Father. Amen. He's the Prince of Peace. My God, so we can rejoice in all situations. Hallelujah. So from day to day, he's leading me on, and I know where he's leading me. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. Praise God to that bright land of beautiful dawn. Amen. I want to let you know a little bit something. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Not an earthly change. It's going to pass me to depart. Amen. Not an earthly change. It's going to draw me away from him. Amen. Because that land. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Again, Moses, why it could be so effective and why it stands out so much. As you know, I just love these verses 11 from 21. Go down there. Amen. Where he says that, of course, amen. He wanted to suffer affliction, ill treatment, rejection. Amen. With the people of God. Amen. Praise his name because he recognized. Amen. The Bible said that he had respect unto the recompense of the reward. Amen. My God. My God. Amen. We know to get there, it's the process. We know to get there, it will be valid. We know to get there, it will be, of course, amen, hills. Amen. To be mountains. Amen. Praise his name, but we're going to get there. Because he is leading us on to a beautiful dawn. Amen. Praise his name. Praise his name. Amen. I've been made a child with a homeward start. I love the Lord deep down in my heart. Amen. I've been made as a child. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name. To have the attitude of a child. Amen. And to follow instruction. To Amen. Follow the leading of the Lord. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. And as the, the praise God, John would have right. Many cases, the Malachi children are right unto you. Amen. Praise God. Jesus, while he was here, take a young child place before Amen. This happens and he says, unless you become as a little child, this little child, you will no wise enter the kingdom. Amen. So we have to have all these principles and attitude and understanding. Amen. To make it into the kingdom. Amen. Praise God. Oh, praise his name. Praise his name. Amen. But you know what? Amen. This has become to me. Amen. The last. Amen. Verse says that such boundless, precious, glorious love. You know, send it to me. The Father is coming from above. From his dear side, I want you to know I'm not going to depart. Amen. Like Elijah and Elisha. Amen. Amidst all that Elijah did. Amen. Amidst. Amen. Praise God. All that Elijah said to Elisha. He recognized what was in the man. He recognized that he was in need. My God. Amen. To be beside this man. Amen. He could have not left him. Amen. Because he had a desire. Amen. Praise God for the double portion. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. Oh, praise his wonderful name. God is a good God. Let us love him. With all our heart. Oh, praise his name. Let us continue to give him praise. Praise God. Amen. The Lord's Supper. Very important. Praise God. Speak of the Lord's Supper. The Lord's Table. Speak of communion. We speak of, of course, Amen. The Eucharist. With for the Catholic. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. But in the scripture that we have before us in the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 11, then of course, amen. There are four things there I'm not able to go through them. But of course, in this scripture, he was showing the Corinthians that they should be mindful. Amen. Praise his name. They should be mindful, of course. Of the past, they should be mindful of the past, amen. Which speak, amen, of the finished work of Jesus Christ. 
because it was not celebrated. Amen. It's finished work. Amen. Praise God. I should be mindful of the past and so that to bring us to thinking. So what I'm saying, when we come to the Lord's Supper service, we must take all of these things into consideration. Why are we here today? And why are we just in white? Signify purity. Amen. And why are we, amen, praise God, going to be having Lord's Supper? Where we eat, where we drink of the, the wine, eat of the bread, drink of the wine. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. Yes, so of course, amen, he draw their attention as we read this passage of, amen, of the past. And of course, when we go to high school, then we could see it was in prophecy from way back. Amen. amen. That of course, amen, praise his name. Amen, a Savior would have come. And the sixth verse, well known, we use it mostly in Christmas time, but it's for the church, it's for the Christian to use all year round. Amen. Amen, amen. praise his name. Behold. Behold. Yes, I'm quoting Isaiah, and I want to hear the church in one voice. Amen. Praise God, Isaiah. Nine that we have read in the sixth verse. Behold a virgin. Yes, we're ready. Behold a virgin. And his name shall be called. All right. Oh, praise his name. Because, as we understand, the saving his people. Taking them out of darkness, place them in marvelous light. Amen. Marvelous light. Oh, praise God. Yes, so he speaking of the, the past there. Praise his name. And of course, I was saying, for unto us a child is born. Amen. Unto us a son is given. I want you to know. Although he is from God, he's from the Godhead. Amen. Although it says the Creator. Amen. But the government shall be upon his shoulders. Amen. His name shall be called Wonderful Counselor. The, the Mighty God. Cannot be compared. The Mighty God. Amen. The Everlasting Father. The Prince of Peace. What? Amen. Praise God. Word. Amen. Praise his name. And of course, when the backtrack, amen, praise his name, would understand that, of course, the first verse, nevertheless, the dimness uh, shall not be such as uh, in our vegetation. When at first, amen, he lightly afflicted the land of discipline and uh, the light. Amen. And afterward, did more grievously reflect by the way of the sea. That want to go so far. Okay? The second verse. The people. Amen. The people. Amen. Walk in darkness. Have seen a great light. Amen. They that dwell in the land of the shadow of death. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Unto them are the light shine. We all were dead. In trespasses and sin. So when we draw to the Lord's Supper, come on, I hope you're following. Amen. I mean, we must take for us to celebrate, for us to really, amen, magnify God, for us to be joyful. Amen. Especially in the Lord's Supper service. Amen. For us to understand, because we have our liberator, amen, that He had set the space, He had gone to, amen, praise God, we have Him as our example. That while he was here, it was not easy for him. They do him so many wrong. They spot upon him. Amen. They put sword in his side. Him and they speak somewhere that was grievous. Amen. Amen. Yet he humbled himself. Amen. He went to the cross. My God. Oh, praise his name. So all of these things must be taken into consideration when we come. Amen. To a Lord's supper service. Amen. Recognizing that we were in sin. As Paul Love said, when we were yet without strength. Amen. In due time, God sent for his son. Amen. Born of a woman. Come on, brothers and sisters. We have no way out. Amen. To escape this darkness, the wages of sin, which is death. Eternal, eternal separation from the Almighty God. Now we are in union. Amen. Praise God. Not because we're good. Amen. Not because, of course, amen. Praise his name. We look good. And not because, of course, amen. You know, amen, the Lord, of course, found favor in us, so to speak, but all because he loves us. Amen. Amen. All because he loves us. 
So I'm saying when we come to the Lord's Supper, we need to be excited. The deacon was saying earlier, Amen. But you know what? The opposite is always do. Because the devil knows that's where we get our power, our strength. And each time we keep reminding ourselves, Amen above Amen. This man, Christ Jesus, the wonderful counselor, the mighty God. Amen. Each time we get this privilege, Amen to Amen. Praise God. Speak the word and to refresh our memory of the reality of salvation, the reality of the kingdom in us. Amen. If you can just get us in some bad mood, if you can just get us in some sickly mood, if you can just get us in some confusion, if you can just get us to be mindful of tomorrow problem. <laughs> Amen. He knows. Amen. So we do all these things to keep us in bondage. Because I keep on saying this and I pray God you get it. I will never stop. Because it's a reality to me. The devil knows that the joy of the Lord is our strength. He knows. Amen. So he tried to end us. He tried to keep us away from having joy. No wonder. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Paul to the Philippians. Amen. You speak of joy in the scriptures a few times well. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. Praise God. Come on. Come on. Praise his name. He says we should rejoice evermore. Amen. We should rejoice evermore. Stay. And again. <laughs> My God. And again. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. And again. I say rejoice, friends. I'm not going to stop. Because I realize, amen, I come to that place. I speak about amen, the morning. I speak about amen, the, the, oh, praise God, the process. Amen. I know it takes some time for some people to get there. Amen. Because it's a process. Oh, praise God. Amen. But you call upon God and say, Lord, help me to get zero. That I can rejoice amidst my hurtly sorrows, amidst my hurtly conditions, amidst, amen, praise God, amen, praise God, bad co workers, amen, amen, amidst, amen, bad husband, bad wives, amen, amidst, amen, children, rejection. Come on, friends, amen, help me, Lord, amen, to know that you are the Almighty, amen, praise God, you are the divine. Help us, Lord. Oh, praise God. So, of course, we should understand why. Be mindful of the past. So, we were all guilty before God. He sent his son. And today, he sent us in heavenly places. So, that's why we do this as a reminder. Okay? The second one, be mindful of what is to come. Be mindful of what is to come. So amidst all that is going on, we must be always mindful. That's why we're in church, why we open our heart to the Lord, why we're being baptized, why we're receiving to the church, why we're taking supper. It's of great significance. Amen. We are anticipating the return of Jesus Christ. Come on, friends. Are you following? Amen. amen. So we should be mindful of, amen, not getting our hearts corrupt, amen, not getting, praise God, the, not allowing the devil to get the best of us, amen, praise God. So we should be mindful of what is to come, that of course Jesus Christ will be returning, as you have said in St. John 14, this happens while they were in a sad state because he was leaving. But he left them, of course, with a wonderful consolation that it is expedient, it is better off, it is more satisfying, it is more, of course, amen, it will accumulate more if I go. Amen. And you know what? I want to tell you that because I am going, you know my reason for going? Because I love you so much. Amen. Because this world is so unfriendly. Amen. I purpose. You got it? purpose to take you out of this misery. Amen. Come on, friends. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. So it's a good place for you. Amen. And I'm coming back to receive you. Amen. I'm coming back to receive you. My God, the church of God, if we can just get excited. My God, about the love of God. 
Amen. I mean, I reach to a place standing here. Amen. And I just magnify God. It's nothing about me that I learned the church. Amen. That the devil's mission is to get us sad, is to get us confused. Amen. But I serve a God. Amen. That He gave me a peace. Amen. That I can rejoice and I can praise Him in all situations, in all circumstances. My God. Yes, so of course he says, I'm coming up for you. And why I'm coming to receive you. Oh my God. My Lord. And to myself. Come on, friends. We're talking about we must be mindful of the what is to come. We must be mindful of what is to come. So that will give us the energy. It will give us the strength when we come into worship service. Amen. Praise God. That will give us amen. Amen. The vigor. Amen. Praise God. We're coming to the worship service because we are anticipating, my God. Amen. Our Redeemer, the Divine, to return to receive us unto Himself. That where He is, we will be there also. Time is short. I'm not to say this. Time is short. Amen. Praise His name. The third one. Amen. That we should be mindful of our own heart. My God, with all this anticipation, we should be mindful of our own heart condition. We should be mindful of how healthy, how, how unhealthy our heart is. We should examine ourselves. Amen. We should examine ourselves. And let us do a thoroughly examination as we come and as we are preparing, praise God, even now. And we have that text with a in the context as Paul would have said, well, look here, in other words, I am not a judge. I am not your judge, rather. Amen? Praise God. He says, Amen. Nobody can examine me as I can examine myself. Nobody can examine you as you can examine you. So he says, let everyone examine themselves. Amen? Come on, brothers and sisters. And if you're right, then one more time. To be the name of Jesus. Amen. And says, Lord, help me to, to do a thoroughly examination of my life. Of my life. Oh God, I just cannot do it without you. Help me, Lord, to be truthful to myself. Because I expect your return. It is my desire, Lord, my desire, Lord to, go to go with you. And when you return, when you return I, want I want my heart to be in good condition. I will hope this be the name of Jesus. Clap your hands and give the Lord worship. Clap your hands and give the Lord worship. Clap your hands and give the Lord worship. Oh, praise his name. Praise his name. Amen. And the last one. Amen. We should be mindful. Amen. Of others. Mm. My God. We should be mindful of others. It's in John 13, 35. Amen. Praise God. I think also so many times, but it means so much to me. Turn your Bibles right there. Highlight it in your Bible. If you never mark your Bible, mark this one for the first time. Amen. Oh, praise his name. Amen. St. John 13, 25. Praise God, and I want to hear the congregation read it in one voice. Amen. St. John 13, 35. Praise God. So, of course, we are saying the last one. Amen. We should be mindful of others. And that is in the 33 verse of the scripture that we are representing. Huh? Okay. Oh, praise God. Okay, so we want to put tongue in there. But, of course... Yes, we're going to read from verse 31 to 38. Are we there? 31, St. John chapter 13, 31 to 38. Let's go. Read us. Therefore, when he was gone out, Jesus said, Now the Son of Man glorified. God glorified with him. If God be glorified in him, God shall also glorify in himself and straightway glorify him. Look at children. Look a while, I will be with you. You shall seek me 
And as I said unto the Jews, that go ye cannot come. So now I say to you, in the new commandment I give unto you, ye should love one another. As I have loved you, and also love one another. By this all men know that ye are my disciples, if ye love one another. Simon Peter said unto him, Lord, whither goest thou? Jesus answered him, Whether I go or canst follow me now. Come again, listen to the context now. Because we just said it will be coming back, alright? To receive what's unto him. Reverse. Amen. Praise God. 36 again. Simon Peter said unto him, Lord, whither doest thou? Answered him, Whether I go or canst not follow me now, but thou shalt follow me afterward. Peter said unto him, Lord, why cannot follow thee? I will lay down my life for thy sake. Jesus answered him, Will thou lay down thy life for my sake? Verily, verily, I say unto thee, The cock shall not crow, if thou wast denying me thrice. That was kind of a heart rending with this love and passion that Peter had for the master. But as we know, he could have not. Amen. Praise God. Go with the Lord. Because the Lord, amen, Jesus Christ, amen, of course, is the seed of the world. And he have to go through it all Thanks, by himself. We have to go through it all by ourselves. Amen. Praise God. So I was on the last one there. Um, that of course, we, amen, should be mindful of others, right? Amen. And this fellowship. You speak of fellowship. Amen. Praise God. Amen. My God. And this was a short time. And this, of course, must have hit the disciples to hear the master say that. But of course, the condition, you say we're doing it, amen. All of these that were saying, amen, the heart was not right. Amen. Oh, praise God. Amen. The attitude, the perception was not right. I have seen friends that just do not fall into the same category at all. We get too much. We have too much examples to fall into the category. Let us get it right. Amen. Amen. That when we come together, we come for the better. Amen. Oh, praise God. We have their example to draw from and to correct ourselves. Amen. Oh, praise God. A lot to say. And I have some preparation that I have a topic that I do want to use to bring it out. Amen. But of course, today we magnify God. Amen. And we just want to, amen, continue to love Him and trust Him. Okay. Yes, and uh, we also recognize from the book of uh, St. John 13, where we read many times for the washing of the saints feet. Okay, so the Lord's Supper, of course, it takes in. COVID have caused us for a very long time. Amen. Praise God. Like to have to exempt the washing of the saints feet. But thanks be to God, we have resumed that for some weeks, or some months now rather. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. And also with that, we have seen how much as we said we should, amen, concern for one another, the lost ones here. Okay? Praise his name. We should be mindful of each other. So when he says, of course, when you come to the supper, amen, praise God, don't go before the other. Wait for one another. Amen. Jesus Christ, he was binding them together. Are you following? Yes. Amen. And I'm saying to us, let us see to it. Amen. As he was bashing the confusion, he was bashing the, the mindset. And some word that he used there, amen, was that they, they were harsh when they come together. Amen. If there is if there is a confusion and some word that is used, every season. Okay. Amen. Strife and debate. And all these things. Amen. Strife and debate. But thanks be to God, we have learned. Amen. Praise his name. That being a child of God, we are a new born, born creation. Amen. We've been made over by the precious blood of Jesus Christ. We have been transformed to his precious blood. Amen. We have received power to overcome the obstacles. And that is the 
blessing and the beauty, not in our own strength. Amen. But we have received power from the Lord to forgive those that misuse or abuse us. We have received power, amen, to say, my brother, it's all right, it's okay. I forgive you. Come on, friends. Amen. My God. I'm too long. All right. Let us stand. Oh, praise God. Oh, praise his name. Oh, praise God. Let us do a session of worship. Everybody, everybody, just worship. Just worship the Lord. 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 You are worthy, Lord. We thank you, Lord. My God, you have left the splendor of heaven. You have left the splendor of heaven. Knowing your destiny, Lord. You know that you would have been rejected. You know that you would have been despised. And you would have been led as a lamb to the slaughter. You know. And so we worship you today. That you have left the splendor of heaven. You have come to sinful hurt. You have lift us up out of our mess. Out of our misery. You forgive us of our sins. My God, you have placed us in heavenly places. Where we can rejoice. Where we can have joy. And so we just magnify you. We worship. We bow down. And we worship at your feet, Lord. The worthy Lamb. The worthy King. The mighty God you are. Oh, we thank you. 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 Thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you, Lord. We adore you, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, praise this wonderful name.